Here at Allen O'Connor Orthodontics, we think it's really important to get out and serve the community that we're a part of. The month of February is Dental Health Month and we go into over a dozen local schools and participate with third grade students. This year we're going to reach out to over 1,400 students and educate them on brushing and flossing, the importance of taking good care of their teeth. We also review um, sugars and the amount of sugar in each drink. I also bring in my animal collection of teeth because that's one of the cool things I collect is animal teeth. So I share those with the children as well. Throughout the fall and winter, we collect canned goods and non-perishable food uh, to take to local food pantry drives uh, for the homeless. And with that, we also give points or rewards to our patients for bringing in that food, um, and we deliver that on a weekly basis. We have a coat drive in the fall. In October, our office turns pink. We wear pink scrubs, we have pink gloves, we have pink masks, and then we encourage our patients to go pink as well. So if they get pink on their braces, we donate $2 each person that participates to three local breast cancer awareness and um, supporting charities in our local community. Also in October and November, we collect candy. They can bring in their candy and for each pound of candy that they turn in, they get a reward point and we donate that candy to the USO. Last year we donated over 300 pounds of candy. Another cool event that we did this August and we've been doing the last several Augusts is a water walk and that takes place in Wyoming and it goes to support, um, we did two wells in Africa this last year um, so that we can provide water to those less fortunate. Last year we hosted Give Kids a Smile and we are also involved in kids, Give Kids a Smile and we deliver care to patients that don't have insurance. Last year we saw over 120 patients out of our office and we're happy to be supportive of this organization and give dental care to kids that are less fortunate. Another organization that we are affiliated with is Buckets of Love. Um, one of our patients founded this organization and they take a, a bucket of joy to patients that are in the hospital, um, full of toys and fun things for children to enjoy and brighten their day. And then the last thing that our staff loves to do is the Lewis Parade. So we get out and we decorate a float every year, we start planning. The year before, last year was the Grinch. We've had some really fun um, times with it. We decorate a whole float. The staff gets together and we go walk around, hand out candy, toothbrushes of course as well, and glow in the dark sticks. It's, um, it's a great time. We want to serve those that are less fortunate than ourselves. Uh, I also think that it brings our team together and it's one of the things that differentiates us from many other offices and, and just other workplaces is that we come together as a team and we get involved in all of these events and we support each other and we all feel better because we do this.